Good evening. My name is Jesse Ryan, and I'm Executive Vice President at the Campaign for College Opportunity. And as you know, the campaign has had a longstanding commitment to fixing the broken transfer system, starting with historic change in 2010 to create the associate degree for transfer, guaranteeing admission to the CSU system and continuing efforts to untangle the transfer maze in 2021 through AB 928 and AB 1111, work that could not have been done without the courageous leadership, the commitment, and the dedication to comprehensive transformation that we saw from our next honoree. It is my great pleasure to present the distinction in transforming transfer to assembly member Mark Berman, who emerged as a star championing master plan 1960 uh, select committee work to delve into the systemic inequities plaguing student pathways. If it had not been for his willingness to dig in and pursue this type of transformational policy, we would not be sitting with you this evening. I also want to thank the student leaders who were the voices behind pushing for transfer to continue to rise to the top of priorities in creating racial equity and access as well as opportunity for all students across the state. It's my pleasure to introduce one student who led the way, Tariq, who has been Azim, who has been a student leader, a fierce voice as the UC Davis transfer student and vice chair of governmental relations at UC Student Association. We are so grateful to have you share your gratitude with assembly member Berman for his work. Thank you, Jesse, for that uh, amazing introduction. Uh, once again, uh, my name is Tariq Azim and I'm a fourth year student at UC Davis. A little over four years ago, I wasn't eligible to apply to a UC. I didn't meet the GPA requirement. After two years at Chafee College, I transferred to UC Davis and I'm now getting ready to graduate less than five months from now. Community College was more than just a second chance to me. It was the best choice and it was my gateway to a high quality, low cost education. But even then, I still faced challenges in navigating the transfer process. While I personally could transfer within the two year time frame, this is not the reality for many of our students. 19% of students transfer within four years and 28% transfer within six years. The transfer system is broken. It's complex, inequitable, and gatekeeps marginalized communities in California. It is in the UCSA's mission statement to advocate for the accessibility, affordability, and quality of the UC system. So of course, we happily co-sponsored AB 928 and led advocacy efforts for students throughout the state. A coalition of transfer student leaders from all three higher education segments voiced our support for this progressive bill because we knew based on our experiences and the students we advocate for that this would genuinely transform transfer. Thank you so much to Assemblymember Berman for always being a strong, strong higher education advocate by pursuing policies that increase access to educational opportunities in California. A lot of hard work went into the passage of AB 928, and I know many of us are excited to see its implementation. Once again, thank you so much for your leadership, and I am now proud to present Assemblymember Mark Berman with his Dean's List Distinction in Transforming Transfer. Thank you so much, Tarek. Really appreciate that. And, and thank you, Jesse, for, for your kind words. And, and thank you so much for you know this awesome award that I can't wait to put up uh, on my office walls here in, in, in the new kind of quasi-capital that we have here in Sacramento. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I'm so honored to be here today to join such a distinguished group of recipients who have demonstrated their commitment to increasing college opportunity for all California students. Uh, I want to thank the Campaign for College Opportunity for this recognition and for their effective and continued advocacy on behalf of student voices. It is especially meaningful for me to have Tarek present this award. As a transfer student, he knows firsthand the challenges that too many students face. Over the last five years, I've held hearings across California to discuss higher education issues from Sacramento to Fresno to Riverside to Zoom. Uh, and when students discuss their experience with the transfer process from community college to four year university, their message was loud and clear. Transfer is broken. It's too complex, confusing and difficult to navigate. Instead of being a clear path, it's a maze and it's costing students time and money that they can't afford. 
70% of first-time community college students say they want to transfer to a four-year university. However, only 19% of students with a transfer goal successfully transfer within four years, and only 28% transfer within six years. This is absolutely unacceptable, and it was a call to action to transform transfer. Last year, I authored two bills to do just that. AB 928, the Student Transfer Achievement Reform Act of 2021, which reimagines transfer from the student perspective. It removes barriers to the successful but underutilized associate degree for transfer and establishes a single general education pathway that meets transfer admission to both CSU and UC. And AB 1111, which removes another transfer barrier by requiring comparable community college classes to have the same course number, reducing student confusion. And I'm thrilled that Governor Newsom's recent budget proposal doubles down on these transformational higher education reforms with substantial funding to implement both bills. I'm so grateful to all of our uh, supporters of these of, of these bills, and especially the co-sponsors, the Campaign for College Opportunity, Lieutenant, Lieutenant Governor Kunalakis, Cal State Student Association, UC Student Association, and the Student Senate for California Community Colleges, to Michelle, Jesse, and the whole Campaign for College Opportunity team. Thank you for your partnership and for this honor. Uh, I remember when my legislative director, Ellen Green, who also deserves a huge shout out, uh, first brought the idea for 928 to me uh, about a year ago. And it was three distinct parts. And Ellen asked me which one I wanted to pick. And I said all three. Uh, and that's exactly what we did. And our partnership was able to uh, make this effort successful. So I look forward to continuing to work together in the years ahead. And most importantly, to the students, you inspired these transformative changes. And I share this award uh, with all of you. So thank you so much. Mm -hmm.